Here we can see my Zotero folder, uh, my Zotero app, which is open. Here we can see my Zotero app. I've got it open here. I'm in the main library and we can see a list of many different items that I've added into the library over time. And these are all in the library and they're in individual folders as well. So items that we have here can be in many different individual folders as well as being in the main library. Now, to make a folder, we can see there's a yellow plus folder button in the top right hand co left hand corner. So when we click that, we can just give it a name, call it ABC1, and that will appear near the top here because the folders are put in alphabetical order. Now, because this is a newly created folder, there's nothing in it yet. But if I go back to the main library, select an item, I can easily drag and drop that item in to the folder. So the item will be here in the folder and it will still be in the main library. So again, as I mentioned, we can drag and drop items to have the same item in multiple folders, which makes for very useful management of different sources for different folders for different writing projects.